Hi there guys and welcome back to another video. This one is going to be a little bit of a ramble so uh, feel free to listen and escape at the same time you don't have to watch on screen but I'm going to talk a little bit about future plans and my new PC. So to start off with then in the background is just going to be a phase 10 and 11 of Green Bomb uh, week at Raga whilst doing 4 man hard mode. Um, so this is pretty decent uh, phase 10 and 11 if you haven't seen it done before and just wondering what the methods we use which helps us get the kill every time in 4 man hard mode. Now this is obviously green bomb week and so obviously some weeks are easier than others. This clip is pretty much um, a good, it's a really good phase 10 and phase 11 we had slightly bad RNG because I had a green bomb spawn on me when I was the Kada uh, and intercepting others but never mind apart from that it was pretty solid. Anyway so moving on to what I want to talk about. First off some of you will know that I built a new computer myself a couple of weeks back now uh, so I now have the functionality to stream on Twitch I kind of wanted to try it for a while, but due to my old laptop, it just wasn't a gaming laptop at all, and this just wasn't possible. Anyway, so now I have my new PC, and uh, I will leave a link in the description to which shows what I built and uh, my components. But I've been doing a little bit of streaming on Twitch recently, and found it really fun. Um, it's just nice to be able to interact with you guys, answer questions, that kind of stuff, as well as just enjoying PVM as usual. Now I understand that not everyone enjoys streaming or watching streaming like I didn't used to and now I quite like it, it's fairly chill and mainly due to my PC I can actually watch streams whilst doing other things which I didn't really have the capability to do before. But if you guys are interested in watching me stream uh, then do check out my Twitch, give me a follow and hopefully see you guys over there sometime soon. It will mainly be stuff like Virago, Duo, Trio, uh, maybe small, small team hard mode plus really anything else I'm doing for Insane Final Boss. This brings me to my next point which is a little bit about what are my future plans on RS um, and the fact that I haven't really played much recently due to work and then I went on holiday last week um, but I do intend to try and continue with my insane final boss grind. Uh, I actually have a fair amount of KC now at both Gregorovich and Hellweir uh, so I'm at 800 normal mode or above um, but not on the next threshold so I just need to basically go and do my challenge modes and hope for pet there. And then in terms of Corp, I have 1.7k kills, so slowly getting there. One thing I thought might be fun was to, would be just to host a few Corp masses on stream. I knew there's still a fair few people after that pet, and it's really fun in like a legacy mass or something, just really quick kills, etc. The last thing I guess is just a little bit about Talos. Uh, that is after those pets I've just talked about, my only pet that will be uh, holding me back from Insane Final Boss. Now, I did make a video about Talos and against Farago and the pros and cons, um, but aside from sort of, I know a lot about Telos, but I haven't actually done that many kills. I've watched lots of streams, spoken to lots of people. Um, so I do need to start doing that myself. Uh, as I said in my other video, I do prefer team-based PVM, which is probably why I haven't really had an urge to really go and, and enjoy it. But on the other hand, Telos is extremely good money at the moment. If I can get decent at it and build up some streaks with decent enrage. So every orb drop that you do manage to get, I mean, I know they're pretty rare is about 600 mil so that's very good money and not really much else in the game competes at the moment. The other thing I said is that it's probably going to be something that I don't find myself doing on weekdays just because coming home from work is kind of the last thing I want to do um, end up dying a load or at least when I'm learning I might be find it a lot more relaxing once I'm actually decent at it but I'm still sort of coming home occasionally just doing a, couple of, a trip or two of Virago um, it's kind of a lot more chill I know what I'm doing um, and I can also just talk to other people whilst I'm doing it. And lastly to finish off, I've had a few people ask me on the topic of Virago if I'm going for a third vit or not. And the answer is no, not really. Um, I still enjoy Virago, I'll still keep doing it um, with people that want to go etc. But there are still lots of people that need one and I'm, you know, I won't be keeping it in the house unless I'm in a full vit team. Um, but also I should probably keep dreaming considering they are so rare. And it took me like two years to get another one by accident, so we'll see. That's it for this one, guys. Thanks for listening to my ramble yet again, and I hope to see as many of you as possible over on Twitch. As always, guys, like and comment down below if you'd like to see me stream anything specifically, and uh, sub if you're new and you like the content.